Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I am going to show you a super cool trick to turn any photo into a stunning watercolor painting using Photoshop's generative fill feature. But here's the kicker. I'm also going to share how you can monetize this skill and earn a passive income online. So stick around till the end. Let's dive right in. First, let's try changing this photo into a painting using Photoshop's generative fill feature. So I'll select the entire canvas and type in turn to painting, click generate. And as you can see, it doesn't quite work as expected. But don't worry, I've got a trick that works every time. Here's what you need to do. First, click this button right here or hit the Q key on your keyboard for quick mask mode. Next, press Alt Backspace on Windows or Option Delete on Mac to fill it. Now, set your foreground color to gray. The darker the gray, the closer the painting will resemble the original image. I'm going to choose a slightly darker gray. After that, press Q again or, or click on this button. It shows this warning as the selection is transparent just hit OK. Now let's type watercolor into the generative fill and click generate. Boom! We've got a beautiful watercolor version of our photo. You can even create more variations by clicking generate again. I really like this fifth one so let's go with that. But wait! There's more! Let me show you how to bring back some original details to make this artwork even more striking. Make a copy of your original photo and bring it to the top. Create a mask layer and fill it with black. Select a soft brush. Set the foreground color to white. and gently brush over the areas where you want to bring back the details. See how we added more detail to the eyes and lips? It looks much better now. Now, let's get creative with some watercolor brushes to add even more artistic flair. First, hide the current layer, then create a white filled layer below these layers. Create a new layer and let's open the brush window by clicking Window and then Brushes. Here you can see all your available brushes. I'm going to install some watercolor brushes. Just go to File, Open, select the watercolor brushes you want and click Open. You can download these brushes from the link shown in the description below. Once installed, select a watercolor brush, set the foreground color to black and adjust the brush size. By creating separate layers for each stroke, you can easily edit them later. Group these brush strokes together and then reveal the layers we hid earlier. Now let's select these two layers. Right click on it and click on create clipping mask. As you can see we've added a lot more creativity to our watercolor painting. I want to hide these brush strokes now and add another few more brush strokes in a new layer. You can always go back and tweak the strokes or add more until it's just right. Okay. 
Okay, done. Let's give this painting a real tactile feel by adding a handmade paper texture. Create a new layer on top and fill white color. Go to filter, filter gallery and apply the texturizer and grain filters with these settings. Then set the blending mode to multiply and reduce the opacity. Done. Now our artwork has a beautiful paper texture. The best part? You can continue customizing this artwork anytime by adjusting brush strokes or adding more watercolor layers till you are happy with the result. Now it looks perfect. Let's take this to the next level and prepare it for print. If you want to print this and gift it to someone, you'll need to upscale it to a high resolution image. Head over to pixelcut.ai and click on Upscaler. Select 4x and upload your artwork. After a bit of processing, you'll have a highly detailed version ready to download. Now, our final watercolor painting is ready to print and it looks absolutely stunning. As you can see, the upscaled artwork has very high details. Now, let's talk about how you can monetize this skill. You can sell it as a service on platforms like Etsy and Fiverr. Let's check out Etsy first. Search for photo to watercolor and you'll see some best-selling listings. Let's open this listing. It have a price of around $11. Interesting thing is that it already got around 2000 plus reviews. This shows that there's a high demand for this service and you can make a decent income selling on Etsy. Next, let's hop over to Fiverr. Search for photo to watercolor painting. You'll find lots of gigs offering similar services. Here's one that's doing really well. It seems that you can earn a passive income by selling your AI enhanced watercolor paintings on Fiverr too. That's it for today folks. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and that you're inspired to create and even sell your own AI generated watercolor paintings. If you like this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more content like this and drop a comment below if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.